Hey guys, hope everybody had a good week. Um, I did, but I've been going through some tough stuff as well. You know, life stuff, like you do. And I heard a couple of things that I really liked this week that I wanted to share with you because I found them to be really helpful for me as I go through this tough time. I'm talking to a really good friend of mine. I call her my sage. She's so wise and really cool. Um, and, you know, we were talking about moving on. And I've always seen it as moving forward and you have to get there as fast as possible and you have to do it the most efficient way and just, you know, come hell or high water, you plow through everything and that's how you move forward. And she kind of laughed and was like, well, that's one way, but you know, it's not moving forward, it's moving on. And a lot of that time is done zigzagging and even meandering around and kind of, you know, feeling your way through it. And eventually you get there, you move on, you get to the goal, but not necessarily in that A to B line that I was shooting for. And I thought that was really cool. I liked that a lot. And I was talking to my mom about this stuff too. And um, she came up with something that's like so simple, but really spot on. You know, she was telling me it's kind of like going to the grocery store. And I was like, all right, I'll, I'll listen. And, you know, she's like, well, you got to go up and down the aisles and you have to collect the things that you need. And, you know, you might find yourself in the cereal aisle and you didn't anticipate needing cereal. So now you have to backtrack and, you know, go get milk because you didn't plan on having cereal. But now you have it and now you need milk too. So you got to, you know, go back and get that. And you might go in there with a list or a plan, but it doesn't always work out that way. And, you know, it's kind of just this, kind of go back to the meandering, you know, it's up and down the aisles and um, you can't just go to the register with your cart at the beginning, which I really laughed at because I was like, brilliant, that's how you win at grocery shopping. Just go to the grocery store and then just head to the register. And of course, I love that image. It's really funny. Um, but she's right. You know, if, if I were to do that, I wouldn't have any of the supplies that I needed. Um, and of course, you know, looking at kind of the tough stuff as growing opportunities and learning opportunities, you do have to go through and kind of you know, collect things and um, then you get to the end and you have all of this sustenance now uh, to check out with. And it was simple and just like spot on. Another wonderful reason that I love my mom and I think she's the best. So I just wanted to share those with you. I, I found them really helpful for where I'm at and I hope someone out there will find them valuable as well. You can catch more on the website, www.suddenlycelibate.com. Of course, I am on Facebook and YouTube. You can find me on Twitter at jsexaddict. I'll see you guys with more questions next week.